we'll go ahead and we're going to pour a U. We're going to pour a, probably about a third up this side or a little bit heavy and then heavy across the top and kind of light down this side. So, but it'd be better to have and pour it a foot out from the wall. Foot out right in And then just like what you do. Yep. You're going to be perfect here. A little heavier. Is this the outdoor or just right? A little heavier. Oh, outdoor flex, yeah. Mm -hmm. A little heavier. <laughs> I like a professional. Looks good to me. And then you'll just leave your bucket upside down at the very corner. I'd say usually cutting in my edges like 80% of my time. And then we just 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Oh, you know what? Like it was it. really pretty, and I'm sorry, guys. We just, we covered everything though, because we're just gonna make another pretty floor. Little Timmy talking crap. This is how you're in the world. Not all plastic. <laughs> Somebody can wear do you want to? Yeah. Yeah, just well, make sure, sure, sure your shoes are clean. Yeah. Like, yeah, you want to let somebody else? Yeah, yeah. sure. If it's okay. Just want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. And let's go, let's go, hey, before you keep coming across, go back out. Sure. Let's like, yeah. sorry, let's, let's sorry, sorry. Sorry. Easy, let's easy, easy. It's I work for the... And you're okay with some of that. There, there we go. go. Thank you. Oh, I got tape on your globe. And you don't need spikes on. No. You, should, you should take those off. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I meant just reach out there. I apologize. It's so good to not have to wear spikes if you don't need. What's that? Yeah, a little bit thin. too thin from setting too long. Now go out wider on the ends there. Yeah, just go a little wider on those ends. You know, and just come right back across too, but stay out in it. So now instead of coming down here, just turn just it around turn and come right yeah. back out here and try it again. Just do this. Don't come down the floor. Don't, don't come down the floor. Keep it out there. Do, just go across like this and get a feel for it. Before you pull the squeegee towards you, just feel for it and just smooth that floor out there, out here in it. Out, out in it though. This? Uh-huh. Yeah. And just get a feel for that. And you can tip the head sideways so you're not leaning. Yeah. There you are. Now feel that. You see how smooth that's yeah. getting? You just caught a whole bunch of thick epoxy there. Here, I'm going to stop you really quick there. So we don't need it. I don't care at all if this epoxy gets here. It doesn't matter. Because if this is big low spots and wonky spots, there's no reason to move forward. So let's stay out here and not be impatient. Look at this. Look how smooth. You can get a lot of practice out here too. See this? See how easy that is? And see how I fixed that thin spot there? I don't need to come across the floor just because my squeegee's on the floor. Look at that. See this thin spot here? You guys see that? I could just keep coming down, but I'm just going to take my time. And it's actually really easy. It's good practice to just be out here sometimes and get a feel for that product. See all the thick stuff I'm grabbing up there that doesn't need to be there? So, so just take, but if you want to practice the squeegee, don't keep pulling the pile at first. Now watch how much I, see how I'm cleaning that pile up and getting it really organized? See how... See how little I'm cutting off every time? That'll make the job a lot easier. And now, if you notice out behind me now, I have a really smooth floor. Yeah, I was going for it. Go for it. I was going for it. Oh, no, no, it just takes time. Now, cut off less. See what he did? Ahmed yeah. grabbed it and, and tried to do like three feet all at once. Yeah, that's what I was doing too. Was, was no, no, you're good. You just come back across it. Just keep going because you did it again. Now, now, just don't pull your product. Go back out there and just keep it clean. Now go out there and clean up that epoxy. Stop coming towards yourself. Pick the head up and put it out there on the floor. This guy's gonna make me start praying more than I ever have. Watch out, you're about to step on epoxy. You just did. Talk like this, like this. No, no, no. No, no, you do it, you do it. Just keep going, you're good. Just stay out on the floor more and just clean that up. You're, you actually did pretty good. Just don't keep bringing the pile towards you. <laughs> no, 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 you don't, no, it just takes time. Honestly, how can you get really good at something in the last 50 square feet? You know what, no, just, just like you're doing. Just like, look how much epoxy you have here. So get lots of product over there, get lots of product and bring it right back out on the floor, be nice and thick, now turn your head, twist. Watch this, this is one thing maybe you're not getting and this is what probably nobody gets, is the way to, to angle this, you don't have to move the head to get this. Like you don't have to move like this. You can just twist the head like this. So if I want to bring this pile, so just just practice staying out here for a second, like this, and just stick it out sideways. I want you to do this. I want you to pinch it. You do that. Everybody, it's, all, it's so weird when you're doing it. And it looks so easy, but it's not it's easy. Sweet. It does not look, easy. look very easy. Yeah. It's not easy. That's why when Amber did this, or sorry, April did this, it actually really surprised me because there's never a little girl that can actually do run it. Yeah, she ran. Especially if you don't have a lot of time traveling and doing things like that. So she ran it like 
It was good. It was good. Like, it's because of her dad, probably. Did you make her work her whole life? Yeah. Good for you. Man. Good for you. Got the tree. Bag. Okay, now you can just work it towards you and work work over this way. Now this is your floor. You just pretend it's yours right now. And you cover that where you want to, because no matter how ugly you make it look, I'll fix it. <laughs> totally good. Oh. I think it's about to be the best floor we've ever done. Thanks to you. See, if you come to class, that will build up your self-esteem as well. <laughs> He's actually a really cool uh, dude. How many classes have you been to, too? Second one. And you're always helping, dude. So you're the last class you worked. Or, I think everybody in the last class worked, or they weren't here. Yeah, I've got one. That's good. No, angle it. Yep, that's good. Good. Really good. Keep it going. Yeah. Turn it a little bit. You can dump that pile towards you more. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. You're getting the hang for it. You just need more time on the floor. Now turn it back so you don't lose it all. Oh, yeah. Twist your head though. Twist it to control it. You know, you're just so used to being a pimp, you're not used to just doing this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, you know, tell them you have a white boy like me. People do this for me. Slap me <laughs> 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 Boss is working. I've just I've always been the I've always been the servant. <laughs> look at that! Look at that! Keep going back. That's good. You're getting that so much smoother. Look at that. Right when I thought there was no hope for you, got back and told me there was. Look at that! That right there is playing. That is nice. See that? Ah. I'm gonna forget everything your mom said about you. A couple of more classes, huh? Dude, no, that's actually really good. Ten more classes. Yeah. Go for it. Go for it. That's actually really good what you're doing. See, it just takes a few time. It takes a few strokes to get this. Hang. Right, this one just come come on one more uh -huh. time. Yeah, yeah. Bring that and just start losing that pile over here where it's thin. It takes time. You see that I walk all fast. Now I'm gonna just, I'll help you clean this up. Only, how hot is that bucket of gold? Just only because it's been in there for a minute. Okay. Is there any heat in it at all or not really? Not really. Okay, good. Measure it? No, no, no. You're fine. If you thought it was kind of hot, it'd be a little warm. That's proper use of a spike shoe. Step on here. T-bar to screw the head on. Say what? With the, these puddles, like, you're just going to take all the excess and move it all around? Um, yeah, but I'm still doing this with another color, so now... Um, I don't, those, a lot of these dimples are just little air bubbles that pop. You gonna want your alcohol bottle? <laughs> no, not right now. Well, no, I know, but just in general, you know. Oh, yeah, but, um, you know, I'll probably do the backpack for this floor, though. Okay. Then we'll all go to lunch and pretend we don't know the office sketch really well. Right? So we can get it ready for you. That's only Thank you, sir. Yeah. Cool. Oh, so if you want to do like a dirty pour, something on the top of the turtle, you can leave it you know, like this, right? You can. Oh, yeah. yeah. Now, you want to be careful when you're doing the pattern, and it, this is kind of difficult. You have to be able to get the pattern with the other colors to get up all the way to your wall or near your wall, if that makes sense. Um, or not at all because a lot, I've seen a lot of people try to avoid their wall um, because they won't mask it off or they have baseboards down or something they can't touch. So then the whole way through their floor, they're staying away from the wall and you see this border around their whole entire job that looks really nasty. So, so you have to trial every inch so of your floor if you're doing a bunch of accent colors. Or at least do whatever pattern you do very thoughtfully the same.
I'll leave a few voids of just blue or just gold, but and usually that you're gonna want. If you're doing like a decoration on a big job, you'll have one guy do this whole entire form because you don't want two or three different types of T-bar patterns through this floor. And I'm not worried about T-bar marks right now because I'm spraying a lot of alcohol. If I, and this is a metallic, so it'll hide a lot of that. If I was not spraying uh, heavy alcohol, I'd be getting really careful right now with how much, um, how many stripes and how I left the stripes and what they look like. Yeah. I don't know. I think that looks pretty damn good. What do you guys think? I like it. It's very damn good. Would you spray less alcohol because you got more of those salad color looks throughout it? Um, sometimes you just want to keep like a wood grain pattern or whatever. You just you have a, sometimes you have such a perfectly slight pattern or something that you don't want to disrupt it anymore. Okay. So if you want to like uh, do the decal yeah. on the floor, uh -huh. like you do the vinyl, like uh, maybe the vinyl decal? Yeah, yeah, vinyl yeah. and just pour it over. Uh huh. Pour, pour it clear right over it. And I'll just let it dry for a day or two, because um, a lot of times if you put water in there in those decals when you set them, they can um, water can still be coming out of them. Yeah, just depending on if they set them like that at some point. I can't set some stickers like that without some water. So, do we know where the backpack sprayer might be? Yeah, I'll get it for you. Sorry. Oh, you're spraying this one. Our this is a workshop in our own office. Is there people worried about the walls? They don't like it. If the people a lot don't of like people. this, you come to a workshop and you can Some people guy, but some because people do. This is just gold on caravan, and it's not done yet. So wait till you see it washed with a little bit of alcohol. And don't worry, if you don't like it, I promise your mom already called her office and she's trying to get me to buy your house so I can actually do it right outside the bedroom door. She's okay with you have to call me stepdad. You know the customer here loves it. I'm not gonna walk out there. Looks like what? Well, when he goes on the floor, it doesn't matter. I do think whenever we have yeah. do the coolest if things, a lot of people draws. say they don't like it. Yeah, so. yeah. I do oh, think that a lot of you guys just like to try to pretend you don't like stuff because uh, a, a lot of people do like it. I think a lot of you will. You just don't know how to say it. Is this alcohol? What's this? Is this alcohol? This is alcohol, yeah. yeah. It's a pure tea. Yeah. 99%. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Is it we're trying, you're dripping pretty good. We're trying to get you. know what? Are you trying not to walk on it? Yeah. Oh. The people on the live are saying they don't like it. Yeah, so we're now a lot of people say they like it. So who knows? That's funny. You never know. Okay. I think my, my little alcohol sprayer has lost suction. This side looks good. <laughs> it is working. Slowly but surely, really well. Oh, it's actually. Those sprays are so nice.
popular at a party if that thing was full of tequila. <laughs> oh boy, you open up! <laughs> yeah, exactly! We'll just have to finish it with something else if we don't have alcohol in it. We didn't. <laughs> Apparently, this is the last day of the Let's go into this prayer. It's the cheapest one. <laughs> uh, battery? Three place? No, no, no. The battery's working well. It's, it's the, the pump's not priming anymore. It's, these things get from this. Might be out of alcohol. 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 It's supposed to be water. <laughs> <laughs> Adjusted down to everything. Yeah. It's a source of problem. Appreciate that. I love that. No, not that. <laughs> 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 <laughs
We get the same with breaking effect with regular alcohol as well then, basically with that glitter. Yeah, this is regular alcohol. This is just. Well, I know, but without the turquoise, I mean, basically regular. Oh alcohol. yeah, yeah, without any color. Just you would basically totally just without yes, color. Sir. Man, I don't know, guys. I think that looks good. Do you have any color to that alcohol? Yeah, a little bit of turquoise. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Uh huh. Basically, clear drops. Powder. Yeah, we only do powder in this. Ever. Only powder. Is there a ratio on that? I think we leave it though. I don't think we're talking Get your final squirts in. This is what it looks like the floor of heaven. Floor of heaven? Yeah. Now there's some people that have been seeing. There is. No, there, there is. You're not believing me. Or so I tell myself. Yeah, so I tell myself. Even they like are like, ah, I don't know. He doesn't sound very hot. So this floor is sexy with the lights off. I promise if you came here and squinted really hard with one eye, you would love it. So thank you for watching. It was a lot of fun. And we got to work without some people. So, And we'll do an after video where Michael will show us exactly what we did. And we'll probably be putting a coffee stand up here. Um, thank you guys for watching the live. I hope you guys watch again later today. And we'll be back later. Kill a pedophile before I see you.